because it's a lot. Ah, shit. It's a lot of people in jail and uh, they just forget that they're loved. A lot of people facing murder charges or whatever, doing life, and there's just a lot of negative energy in jail. And I just wanted people to just get reminded that uh, they're loved. But when I was singing it, I was singing it full of joy. And I would never forget this. I was singing it full of joy, and I was singing it as loud as I could. Now, I only told uh, probably like three people this story. Uh, but I'm going to tell all my subscribers and everybody who's following me and the world this story today. So I was singing that story as loud, I mean, singing that melody as loud as I could. And I was singing it full of joy. Now, when I was done singing it, um, I laid, I laid down. I laid down to my right, to my right side, and I put the blanket over me. And I, and I, as soon as I laid down, I started crying. Right, as soon as I laid down, and I don't know why I started crying, but I just felt sad. I felt so sad and I was laying down on my right arm bundled up in the cover and I was just crying but I wasn't crying for long because I felt the touch and it wasn't like a hand it wasn't like it wasn't like a, a, a palmed hand but it was a touch and it started small, it started real small, but it got, it got bigger. And it, it was so soft, it was so soft, and it felt so, it felt so comforting. touching me I just immediately stopped crying I stopped crying and I kept my I kept my eyes closed I kept my eyes I kept my eyes closed cuz I knew what I was I knew what was I knew what was ever tough I kept my eyes closed because I knew what was what was touching me was spirit was spirit and I'm in human form so if I open my eyes I'm not going to be able to see what was touching me so I just let it touch me uh, and I felt it was, uh, I felt so I felt good and then it was definitely probably like five, ten seconds, probably like ten seconds. And then when it went away, I felt happy. I was so happy. I just started laughing. I was so happy. It was like, I never felt so happy before in my life. Just off that touch. And I jumped down off my bed. I jumped down off the talk monk. And I woke up my celly, I woke up Josh. I said, Josh, Josh, wake up. You would never guess what happened. Oh man, did you hear me singing? He said, yeah. I said, man, I was singing. I was like, Jesus loves you. Boy, he died on the cross for our sins. He's always with you from beginning to the end. And then I laid down and I started crying. I was sad, Josh, and I don't know why I was sad. But but I laid down and I closed my eyes. I laid down, Josh. I laid down and then 
and then immediately I felt the touch. I felt the touch and it was so, it was so soft. It was so soft and it was, and I touched his arm and I said, it started like this and then it went like this and then it just stayed there and it felt so soft. Oh man. And, uh, and then immediately, immediately I was, it went away and we went away. It wasn't that long, but it went away. And then immediately when it went away, I was so happy, Josh. I was so happy, Josh. He was like, yeah. He's like, yeah, you felt the spirit. He said, you felt the Holy Spirit. And I was like, oh, man, Josh. And I was like, a, I was like, I was explaining the story of like a, a, a fan who just seen a celebrity, like a fan girl who seen a celebrity. I was explaining to Josh, Josh, and I was so happy. And I just, I never, I never told any, I told only like three, three people that story. But, uh, uh. That was one of the experience, and it's just like I forgot. I started as I started reading these books and everything. I just uh, as I started reading these books and reading, reading, uh, growing, I started forgetting because, like I say, everything I've been learning. It's been teaching me how to grow and I've been I've been feeling myself. I've been feeling my vibrations raise, my vibrations get higher. It's been teaching me how to grow, but it leaves out God. 